Hi, my name is Emma Fudge and I'm working here at Lake Utopia Paper for the summer with the reliability team and I'm currently studying mechanical engineering. I'm Megan Fudge and I'm taking electrical engineering at Dalhousie University and here at Irving I am working with the divisional engineering group as a summer student. I chose engineering because of my interest in science and math uh, in high school and I also had a lot of encouragement and kind of push to lead me in this direction. I'm not sure if it's something I would have came up with on my own, but a lot of people definitely encouraged me to choose this path. So far, what I like the most about my engineering work and my courses I'm taking is the challenge and how you're constantly busy and always have to push yourself to do it. It's not um, certainly not easy, but it's also nothing to be scared of. I've had kind of an interesting experience as a woman in engineering, uh, mostly because I have a twin sister who's also in engineering and goes to school with me and was in most of my classes. Uh, she's in a different discipline, so we have branched out a little bit. <laughs> but um, it's definitely not something you see every day to see two twin girls in engineering. But um, it's been a help for me a lot to have someone with you. be a little bit intimidating at first, especially like I know myself, I would never have pictured myself working in a mill when I was in grade 11 or 12, but it's definitely not as scary as it may seem and it's a fit for me, I find, even though it's not something I would have expected. So I would definitely encourage it even though you may be hesitant. What I would tell other women and younger girls is to not be scared of it. Um, I guess that's a really common perception that people have is the reason why there's not more women is that they, just, they don't feel welcome or they're not encouraged to. And I would say to young girls who are considering it is to treat it like any other discipline or any other field of work that they were considering and to just evaluate it if that's what they want to do then to go pursue that and try it out and not to hold themselves back. Happy International Women in Engineering Day!